Uh, proud is an interesting word, but I am thankful that we are some of the most hospitable people you will ever come across. Everybody's so nice. Even if they're uh, stabbing you in the back with their words, there's a smile in their eyes. I am proud to be from North Dakota because it is a small but mighty state. There's not a lot of us who leave Maine, and so when you meet another Mainer um, outside of Maine, there's like this instant bond. It's a vast state. You got from Buffalo way up there, and then you got the Big Apple NYC. What I like about it mostly, you can get up four in the morning and get some Hagen Dazs ice cream if you want. And I'm a Midwesterner living in New York City. I feel like it's a great place to be from. It gives you a great, solid foundation. There's a lot of nature there. It's, it's a beautiful, beautiful state. state. It's the king of the great outdoors. If you like seasons, we experience all four of them. I love the sunshine. The quiet and the green. The mountains there are so gorgeous. The sunsets, the mountains, the landscape. If you love flat lands, they have them. Uh, if you love bright blue skies, they have them. I'm proud to be from Arkansas because the heritage that we had. Michigan has its reps of either, sometimes it's two countries, sometimes it's very segregated, but there's a lot of beauty that comes from Michigan. The diverse mix of people that are all from there. There is a lot of diversity. Everyone seems to have a pretty open mind and it's such a weirdly diverse cast of characters, like hippies, survivalists, Colorado bros, crunchy granola people. I think that of the southern states, it is the most interesting by far because of the food and the music and the history. I think what makes Kansas special is the, the people. people. Everybody you meet from Nebraska has a real friendly outlook, a real friendly kind of attitude. The people are genuine and usually very friendly, almost too friendly sometimes. I think the people that live there are really quality people, the good Midwest vibes that we give off to everyone, lots of highs and hellos. When you're driving around, you actually wave as you're driving down the road. I think the Minnesota nice is definitely a component. The sense of the community. The hardworking Midwestern work ethic. I think it raises like a really hearty sort of person. People from Wyoming are very tough. It. Uh, Bill's grooms molds the uh, perfect southern gentleman. I can say that I grew up in like bourbon area. I know all about bourbon, know all about horses. Didn't drink bourbon till college, never had a horse. Well, I'm proud to be an Oklahoman because we're not from Texas. Everything is bigger in Texas. We are known for our hospitality, we're known for our good food, good music. You can't go wrong with our pizzas. I love the seafood. And we have a really good cheese curds. We have a lot of pride in our homegrown stuff. I'm proud to be from Rhode Island because of the great amount of culture we have in our state. The arts culture is amazing out there. Dead Poet Society was filmed in Delaware at St. Andrew's School. Bernie Sanders, Ben and & Jerry's, and the fact that we don't have any billboards. The weather's amazing, our football's awesome, go Seahawks. I like being able to say that I have the most boarding schools in my state. Connecticut has like 500 billion of them. My favorite thing about New Hampshire is the motto, live free or die. We have the chocolate capital of the world in Pennsylvania. It's the sweetest place on earth, which is Hershey, PA. I love that Florida is known to be like the party happening place. Yikes. I think Nevada is really interesting because a lot of people go there just for fun. You can't really say that for a lot of states, so that makes me really proud.